What is up guys and welcome back. In today's video, we jump straight back into Jasmine. Jasmine has been presenting amazing buying opportunities. So in today's video, we're gonna go and check them out. But before we do, drop me a like. And if you're new to the channel, come and join the family. Drop me a sub. Let's get into it. Wowzers, guys. I mean, 59K, 60K, 56K. 60k we have been fluctuating bitcoin is now sitting at the low 59k region and eth is sub 3k now all of the altcoins had been they've been getting super smashed over the past week guys and if you're new maybe you haven't watched these videos before then you wouldn't know that i've been saying on this channel time after time after time you know, before the halving, we're expecting volatility. And after the halving, we're also expecting volatility. So we were already, we're already prepared for this. Okay, we we're expecting this. And again, even when we expect things like this, when they come, it can be difficult. So I know while I'm here and I'm saying, you know, we should have been ready for this. I understand seeing the portfolio go absolutely dumpy. It's not a nice thing to see. But then it does present amazing buying opportunities, guys, because on green days, everybody's sentiment all of a sudden changes. Everybody's going to want to get into things like chain flip, which is one that we've been getting in the members club, okay? Once the narrative does start to change back into bullish, you don't want to be trying to play catch up into these green days, guys. You need to be making the most out of the red days. Now, Now we actually picked up more crypto over the past week because of certain levels that we did hit. And I said to all of you who watch the videos, when we hit these levels, we don't ask any questions, we just take action. So we'll check out our trading view at the end of the video because it's actually quite interesting to see where we are right now but what is going on for jasmine now shout out steffi what's up steph how you doing bro while you're panic selling whales are buying your coins and look at the metrics here guys you can go and check out the metrics there's so many different um websites that you can use to check out the data for certain coins one that i like to use is coin metrics guys and you can actually see that you can change to whatever currency you want i mean we've got bitcoin we've got jasmine here as well and then you can even change it from price to all of these different metrics here if you wanted to go in and see you know what is the actual inflation rate? What's the daily inflation rate? What's the five-year active supply? There's so much that you can do a deep dive into, guys. And I'll leave a link for this in the description. You guys can just go in your own time and, and you can start to research yourself and paint a picture for yourself. But for the purpose of today's video, we'll look at what Steph's posted. And that is showing the price in relation to the exchange reserve. Look at the price. Price is going up. And ever since, this must have been like the beginning of this year, we have been going down, down, down on the exchange reserve. What does that mean? What is the exchange reserve? That's how much Jasmine is available on exchanges. People are not leaving it on exchanges anymore. I am not leaving it on exchanges anymore. You guys should not be leaving it on exchanges anymore. And the big players are not leaving it. And usually when they do start to have withdrawals or outflows from exchanges, a pump is usually to come, guys, okay? When we have exchange inflow, then that is usually when there is going to be a big dumpy. And it doesn't always work like that, but nine times out of 10, that is how it works. So look, we can still see that the available supply of Jasmine is going down. Now, like I said, we check out our trading view at the end of every video. So make sure you do still to the end because we need to check out Bitcoin as well as Jasmine. But look at this. We found a base, guys. Is this going to be the classic cup and handle? And we found our basing pattern before we do start to have our next leg up. I think in the last video, we said our next leg up would have taken us to that 2.5 to 3.5 cents. I mean, this is the weekly and that is a super bullish chart for Jasmine. So while many people may have got in up here and they've started to see Jasmine dip like 40%. This is all part of the cycle and many altcoins will do the same thing because we've actually had an immense move. I know not everybody who watches the video got the same entries as us, but just because you didn't get the entries doesn't mean that others didn't get the entries, okay? And we pumped up immensely from this bear market floor. This is where we started covering Jasmine, guys, okay? So we've been riding this whole time. People will take profits, guys. But when you check out Jasmine against BTC, Look at that. We wicked below but got the bounce. It's really unbelievable how strong we are holding against Bitcoin. This is unusual for an altcoin. Now, this means investors are not willing to trade their Jasmine for Bitcoin and they're not only following Bitcoin price action. And at this stage of the market, you shouldn't just be following Bitcoin. You should just be really accumulating and seeing these past dips as an accumulation phase for our altcoins, guys. Now, when we come and we check out our trading view, I want to show you this because I, sh I shared this with all of the members yesterday and I probably will share 
I'll show you guys what I, what I showed of the members actually. Let me go back into into the Discord. Now, firstly, guys, if you want to be making sure that you're up to date with all of these updates that I post, all of the new positions that I'm posting, all of the new low cap gems, all the new coins and new narratives that I'm posting, go and join the members club. I'll leave a link in the description. Only 25 quid a month. But look at this, guys. Completely filled the top up zone. If we drop below this top up zone, we are going to drop to 52 pretty fast now what we're going to need to see is a sharp reversal to return bullish we scroll down guys and i also let them know the amount of pullbacks that we've had this year okay now everyone's saying oh when is the bull run when is the bull run the bull run really did start once we bottomed out okay we've been going up for for over a year about a year and a half now okay and we were expecting between 59 and 52k look at the pullback that we had a 22%. We've had one, two, three, four, five, 20 ish percent pullbacks, guys. Okay. And we've always recovered. We've always come back from it. But the alts have not fared well in these pullbacks. And that's just part of the game. Now, when we go and we check out Ethereum, we were in the lower area of the supply zone. And we had a demand zone just around 2.7K to 2.2K. Okay. So again, if we do drop into this demand zone, then yes, alts are going to bleed the same way that Ethereum is. However, it is going to be an amazing buying opportunity. And this is going to bring many of our alts to our third buy zone, guys. So we actually had an initial buy zone for a lot of our alts in this channel. I gave them two lower buy zones a couple of weeks ago in anticipation of this week's dump and a lot of our alts have given these two buy zones so so that's why we stayed ahead of the game and we prepared because we didn't just go all in a couple of weeks ago we said right let's leave some spare capital to the side so that we can accumulate lower and that is why the members are doing so well now we check out jasmine guys and we actually did come to buy one and we're approaching buy two does it mean it has to happen no that's why we have buy one and buy two now guys i want to say to you all a lot of you get confused as to why we don't just pump straight up as to why these coins are dumping like 20 30 40 percent i mean what is the dump that we're in from this high here if we said this is the local high we've actually dumped you know 40 percent mm, it was about 45 percent to a lot of investors they just i, I was getting comments saying crypto is a scam you you people on youtube you, you don't know what you're talking about and it's a scam and you're making me lose money i mean if you actually just followed what we did say or what i said at least then you would have been buying jasmine down here okay uh, you know maximum really down here and you'd still be up 250 percent and i know that a lot of you guys maybe maybe you missed the video because you've just got into crypto which is absolutely fine but you guys need to actually understand the fact that there are investors that have larger positions that you're ever going to put into jasmine from an earlier time okay all of the smart money anticipated this breakout that's why we were adding these buy levels here when everyone was in extreme fear. And down here, guys, everyone was telling me that Jasmine's a scam. I was getting comments on my video saying, you're a scam YouTuber. You don't know what you're talking about. Jasmine's going to zero. It's never coming back. It's a Japanese scam. I said, guys, this is this is just the fear. I'm buying the hell out of it. And we actually peaked out at around 489% from our top buy zone. From the bottom buy zone, we topped out at around... 600%. So now imagine all of the whales who are buying hundreds of thousands to millions of dollars worth of jasmine at these lower levels that are now up 600%. They're going to take profits, guys. Okay. On top of that, Bitcoin having corrections, ETH having corrections. It will it will cause alts to have some corrections as well. And um, it's all part of the cycle, guys. Okay. It is all part of the cycle. We just need to understand that we are in an accumulation zone for jasmine right now. And that if you don't take action here, you're going to be doing the exact same thing that you were doing here. You were panicking and you were saying, oh my God, do I buy Jasmine now? How much do I buy? How much do I buy? How much do I buy? You actually start to buy out at the top and then we have a 40% correction and you say, why me? Okay, why you? Because you're still acting like dumb money. All right, don't act like dumb money anymore. We accumulate altcoins in the fear. We haven't even had the altcoin season yet, guys. Okay, so we need to take every day seriously. So my plan, guys, is I've actually bought more at buy one. I'll buy more at buy two. If we do have a really major crash like 52K, then I think this fair value gap down here could get filled at like one sub one cent. 
Could be hopium, but if it comes, I mean, I've got money to the side in case that we do have a crash to 52k. But for now, we've hit buy one and it is looking very tasty for Jasmine. So that's it. Let me know how you're feeling about the current market conditions. Are you bearish? Are you bullish? Have you been buying more? All comments are welcome. And again, if you got this far, make sure to pause the video, go and drop me a sub. I'm going to see you in the next one. Peace, guys.